We are hearing from another witness in the trial of Terry Thompson. He is charged with murder in the death of John Hernandez outside of a Denny's restaurant near Crosby last year. Channel 2's Ryan Korsgaard is live downtown to explain what the witness told jurors about that night. Ryan? And that witness says he saw everything from start to finish, and he would have reacted just as Thompson did that night. 19-year-old Brian Reifkohl stood in court and physically demonstrated on prosecutor Jules Jackson how he said Terry Thompson initially restrained John Hernandez on the ground. Reifkohl first said that they were chest to chest. Then he said Thompson was on top of Hernandez. Standing 5'8", weighing 120 pounds, Reifkohl said he climbed on top of the two and tried to pull Thompson off of Hernandez, but he said he could not move the two. He said he tried to talk to Thompson, but he said Thompson was red and appeared angry. Hernandez family listened to the testimony in court. It's very tough for them to see some of these images, uh, to go through a timeline and to once relive and continue to relive the events that unfolded that night. Uh, but at the end of the day, we hope that uh, more evidence is presented, that a better picture is painted. And at the end of the day, the family continues to hope that there's justice for John. This is video of Thompson as he was interviewed in the backseat of a sheriff's cruiser shortly after the incident. Jurors heard an audio recording of an interview with a witness who said he would have done the same as Thompson that night. The witness said Hernandez's girlfriend kept saying he's drunk. Medical records show Hernandez was very drunk. Less than three hours after the incident, his blood alcohol level was .204, more than two times the legal limit. A deputy there said there was no sign that Thompson had been drinking. And another employee just got down on the ground to show that struggle. We will show that to you at 6 o'clock. We're live downtown. Ryan Korsgaard, KPRC, Channel 2 News.